In Sporty News Today, a tribute to Socrates, Mary J. Blige, a fan of LeBron James, the improbable meeting between Mama Duseko and Joey Starr, Dwayne Wade wears Jordan sneakers again, and David Beckham crazy about Manny Pacquiao. This Sporty News is dedicated to Socrates, who passed away on Sunday, December the 4th at 57. Socrates was named after the philosopher and was a doctor of medicine who chose to play football at a time when, in Brazil, doctors earned more than athletes. Rise Big Brother started and ended his career in the Sao Paulo club of Botafogo. Between the two, he played in the biggest Brazilian clubs, Corinthians, Flamengo, Santos, before trying his luck in Italy with Fiorentina. Elegant, a technical player with all-round vision, the Salasau captain never won the World Cup. But with Zico, he was part of the golden generation of Brazil between 1978 and 1986. Socrates will forever be remembered as a football legend. Tributes were paid to him on Brazilian, Italian and French pitches. He will be sorely missed. LeBron James is very close to the hip-hop and star circuit. In 2009, he appeared in Mary G. Blige's Stronger video. Stronger is the key song off the soundtrack of the documentary More Than A Game, which retraces the life of young LeBron James and of four of his teammates. From his first matches in high school to the NBA. The video featured the two stars in parallel worlds with the singer who sold 50 million albums on one side and the NBA champion on the other. A meeting which really meant a lot to Mary J. Blige, like she told Trey Sports. I love basketball. I, I love LeBron. So being involved with, you know, the whole uh, um, more than a game soundtrack for LeBron with the stronger song, I mean, that that meant a lot to me because I respect him. I respect his hard work. I respect his, you know, when he's under pressure, he just kills, he just shuts everybody up and just, you know, kills the game. So respect to LeBron. <laughs> Since the video shoot, LeBron has become King James. The Miami Heat player was voted MVP, the best NBA player in 2009 and 2010. There's a 23-year-old age difference between them, and yet Joey Starr and Mamadou Sako share the same love for Paris and its football club, Paris Saint-Germain. The meeting between the French rapper-turned-actor and the 21-year-old Paris Saint-Germain captain could be nothing but electric. Brought together by French magazine Surface, the two stars met up for a photo shoot. The result is dark portraits where the two look like something out of a gangster movie. And yet the shoot itself took place in a relaxed atmosphere. Joey Starr even got to take a Mamadou Sako jersey home. Surface also brought them together for a crossover interview during which they retraced their careers and discussed their love for Paris Saint-Germain. Dwayne Wade doesn't hold grudges. Under contract with the Jordan brand, we were wondering how the Miami Heat star was going to react to Michael Jordan's attitude during the lockout. Like other players, he threatened to leave the brand of the former Chicago Bulls player and current Charlotte Bobcats owner. In the end, he didn't go through with his threats. Business is business. You can see Dwayne Wade in a commercial for the latest pair of Jordans, a shoe that lets you fly just like Michael Jordan did at one time. You can be a huge football star and still be a fan of other great champions. That's the case for David Beckham. The Brit is a fervent supporter of Filipino boxer Manny Pacquiao, considered the greatest in the world. Currently on tour throughout Asia with his Los Angeles Galaxy club, Beckham was in the Philippines to play against the local team. The Americans won the match 6-1. Beckham scored one goal before being replaced 15 minutes before the end of the match. At that point, off the pitch, a remarkable event took place. David Beckham headed to the stands to give his jersey still dripping with sweat to Manny Pacquiao. During the press conference, the Spice Boy spoke about his admiration for the Filipino boxer. Uh, I'm a huge fan of him. Uh, you know, he's such a talented man and a, and a good person as well. So um, I know all the players were excited about him being at the game tonight. I saw him walk in during the game and uh, you know, I wanted to meet him and got a picture with him. So it was exciting. It was exciting for us to, to see him. 